Maybe on our way to do a little autocross in a Mach 1. Never done autocross before, but uh, I guess there's a first time for everything. I did it before, I almost wrecked my drag car. It doesn't seem like, like it doesn't seem like there's a ditch for me to go in, so that's a good start. So they have some standing water out here, so we're not gonna be allowed to drive them, but we are gonna go on a ride, which is still gonna be cool because I didn't trust myself anyways, so <laughs> I'm glad that I'll actually get the full experience of a Mach 1. I've heard these things are crazy up there with the GT350 as far as handling goes, so I'm about to see that firsthand. You ready? Yep. Looks like we're going with the 10-speed. How's it going? Dude, how are you? Pretty good. Pretty surreal experience so far. able to take a turn like that that is nuts and it's still slippery when it's dry it's even better what tires what tires are there running on it do you know uh this car has got the sport cup 2 on it sport cup 2 they're holding on I'm from Georgia. Okay. I'm uh, I'm typically a straight line guy. Okay. I have a, uh, a 2016. It's twin turbo. Oh boy. It's got the 6R80 in it. So this is my first time doing any sort of any sort of turning. Sure. But I uh, I ordered a dark horse, so I'm hoping I'm hoping to get into more yeah, of the actual yeah. track aspect of things. It's such a different experience than going in a straight line. Oh, totally. You actually slow like, down and turn. Yeah. It's crazy. Well, that's what these cars shine. Yeah. yeah. Well, I appreciate it, man. Yeah, you That bet. was awesome. We got Chevy about to go out with a C8. Oh, that's a Z06. They're all a Z06. Oh, it's a, line, it's a lineup of Z06. Lineup of Z06s. That is crazy. We're here in the Chevy section. They got their C8 Z06, and we're about to get a ride and see what this thing can do. So you can ride in Mach 1, Hellcat, Supra, and the Z06. We've already done the Mach 1. That was super cool. Now I want to see what this new Z06 is all about. back there needs a little more fuel. How's it going? Good, how are you? Um, pretty good. I bet this is a pretty fun job to have. Not a bad way to spend the day. No. Sure. <laughs> Getting a nice 2.6 miles to the gallon means you're having fun. Smiles per gallon today. Exactly. I think it'll keep coming down as I carry on. Yeah. Alright, you all set? All set.
than I was expecting, man. CO6. CO6. That's awesome, man. I appreciate it. Wow. I was not expecting that, dude. That thing was moving and handling like crazy. And I got a free hat. Uh, I think we're about to head over to the Supra section. They are drifting the Supras like crazy, so that's going to be fun. I want to see what Jay's reaction is, his ride in the ZS6. That thing is insane. Insanity. Insanity. All right, we're about to drift some Supras now. I've been watching these dudes drive, and it's crazy. All right. Uh, how's it going? Good, you? Hopefully good. Let's see what she's got. You must be you must be having a pretty good day, huh? Uh, no complaint. <laughs> no complaint. Just another day at the office. Just another day at the office. Not a bad office to have. Nope. So how much training have you had to have to kind of get to this point? We supposed to know all these before we we start this. I mean, uh, yeah, before working for Toyota, you're supposed to know all this stuff. They don't train you. Right. But um, I don't know. I'm, I'm raised for my life, so. That is crazy <laughs> how you have that much control over that car. Yeah. Yeah, it's funny because uh, people think it's just loose, but it's not. No, I it's... can be any way I want. Like, I, I give different rides. Sometimes I go very wide around the cone. Right. Sometimes I go straight through. Man, that is... I change all It's the, crazy. I can go any way I want. That's kind of oh. like what I do here to not get bored. Yeah. I do a different Well, props uh, to you, time. man. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Come back anytime. Of course, man. I appreciate it. That man can drive and he knows it. He was like, I can put it however I want. It's always in control. And I was like, dude, we were straight sideways and it felt so smooth. That was awesome. Such a different experience from each car. It's crazy how smooth the, just the slide was the whole time. That was wild. That was awesome. We weren't going to ride in the Dodge, but the line got really short, so we're going to give it a try. I'm thinking maybe we can both fit in the uh, in the Charger at once. That'd be fun. How's it going? Good. How you doing? Welcome in, guys. Pretty good. He's going to be your driver for Andy's going to be your driver today. Hey, thank you. All right, All right guys. Y'all good? Everybody's Hard. buckled in, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's such a different experience with each car. The Z06 was crazy all around. I mean, it was the fastest. It felt like the most grounded and the drivers that they had for those were insane. As far as the Mach 1, it's everything they say. It feels like it's, it's up, you never, you always feel planted to the ground. It wasn't crazy as far as acceleration like the, you know, supercharged Z06, but, and then you get to the Supra, nothing crazy fast, a lot faster than I was expecting, honestly, but, the drivers, man. He was having normal conversation, but was sitting there and we were straight up sideways. So, such a cool experience. That is gonna do it for the Barrett Jackson auction. We are running on fumes, but it was fun. We had a good day. And now uh, we can say we saw the dark horse and, it, uh, sat and sat in it and got to talk to Jim Owens and hear all the details about it. So that was really cool. So again, huge shout out to Ford. I still think it's kind of crazy that they got us to come and do this. That's kind of wild, but uh, Hopefully that's not the last time because this was a really cool experience. It was worth it and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. With that being said, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.